Hello and welcome to another episode of Gentlemen's Club Whiskey. I am the pontiff of Japanese whiskey and your Tokyo godfather, Mr. Mark Antimate. Before we get into it, first, the book, 50 Japanese Whiskies. I don't play around with this stuff. I'm promoting it good, man. And uh, beware, anything could show up one of these days. I might even do 50 Japanese soft drinks one of these days, so be on the lookout. Anyways, today we have another fun episode for you. I'm reviewing this beverage from Coca-Cola. This is Coca-Cola Lime. Not an exclusive to Japan, as this has appeared in many different markets in the world, including North America. And actually, I just found out on the internet that this has been seen in Japan before in 2015. But this specific bottling with this exact label on it, the one that I got, I picked this up last year on July 19th, 2021. So been holding on to it, ready to get into it today. It says that this one comes inside of a 350 milliliter size bottle, which is actually smaller than every other Coca-Cola that has been released of a special flavoring in Japan, as they usually do come inside of 500 milliliter size bottles. But for some reason, this is 350 milliliters. And it says that it is 46 kcals, so essentially 46 calories. Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into it. Smells like smells like faint lime. It's there. And the taste of lime is actually quite faint as well. Mm. All in all, it's pretty good. I would say that it's a good tasting soda, good tasting beverage, but the thing about it is it tastes so similar to a normal Coca-Cola. The lime inside of here is uh is negligible. I mean, it's not it's not a complete departure from a normal Coca-Cola. Pretty light. And yes, you can taste the lime quite faint, but yeah, it's good. It's good for what it is, but is it is it worth any additional money? Not like I paid an exuberant amount of pr uh, money for this. I don't remember how much it cost exactly, but it's probably only like 150 yen, if if not that, if probably somewhere between 100 and 150 yen for this, especially considering the size is 150 milliliters smaller. Yeah. It probably wasn't that expensive at the time, but it's not on the market anymore. It's just something that I've been rationing out and uh, finally took the pictures of it so I can piece it together inside of a book collage of all these different sodas that I've been drinking. And yeah, so I finally took the photos and now that I got the photo, I can I can make the video, open it up. It's okay. Anyways, if you can find it, Sure, give it a try, because my whole aim is just to try as many of these unique colas as possible. But if you can't find it, you're not really missing out on anything. Anyways, I thank you guys for watching. Salute to you wherever you may be out in the world. And until next time, gentlemen, keep it classy. Mm -hmm.